Hello, goofballs and Seth Blingers. Seth Bling watchers, Seth Bling people who watch Seth Bling's videos. This is Goofball Josh coming to you with a applied Ocarina of Time. Now, you guys have probably seen Seth Bling's Ocarina of Time, which is over there. So, I downloaded his world. This came along with it. This is basically just the wiring, minus the colorful wool, the wiring inside the Ocarina of Time. And, as Seth Bling said, there are many different applications for this. And I thought, hey, why don't I just put together one real fast? And so, one of the first ideas that came to my mind was a hotel. Now, usually for a hotel, you go up to your room, enter your number, or whatever, or swipe your card, and then you're let in. But what if this was a hotel where you just had to go up to the number pad, type in your code, and then your door opened and let you right on in? So instead of having multiple keypads, you only had one and everyone could enter their code in and it would let them into their own rooms. So that's exactly what I did. I moved the buttons from over here, over there, they're along the side. I moved them all conveniently right here. Kind of looks like a, <coughs> sorry, excuse me, looks like a kind of a hotel-ish thing. And so far I've only installed two doors, just so you can kind of get the idea that yes, you can have multiple rooms. So, I'm just going to go ahead and go right into the first demonstration. This is a very simple code for the first room. This is the orange room, and it is a six digit code. And there are five buttons. So, there we go. My room opened. I like orange. That's why my room's floor is orange. Oh, and it closes. So, it just kind of closes after about five-ish seconds just so that no one else can get in and you'll be able to open your room from the inside of course via a button or something and now just to show you that you can have multiple rooms I will show you the other one it's just the reverse code of the orange room because I couldn't really remember it much else and here we go the last one and the green room opens. And no, this isn't like a filming room or anything. It's just another room with a green floor. And so that closes too. And so yeah, um, there are five buttons, five to the power of six or f six to the power of five. That means there are 15,625 different combinations. So in theory, in theory, there could be 15,625 different rooms with unique combinations. That's a pretty massive hotel. So, I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, I hope you guys are able to find more ideas to use Seth Fink's awesome Ocarina of Time contraption to use this. And, um, yeah, have a very good day.